This is how we'll install the Super Chips Flash Pack into your Jeep. First you want to locate on the vehicle. Then you want to take the connection for the tuner and simply plug it in to the diagnostic port. That time, it'll power on and bring up your vehicle make and also menu options for the tuner. Okay. Next up is to go ahead and tune the vehicle. Now you're going to see two options for tuning. Quick tune will tune your engine. Advanced tune will also tune your engine, but it'll also allow for applicable features like tire size and gears. Once we select our quick tune for this video, it's going to tell me to go ahead and turn my ignition on. Simply turn the key on to the accessory position where it's not running. We're going to go ahead and push the OK on our keypad. Brings up a list of items that we want to make sure we have shut off on the vehicle. We'll OK through the screen here. Okay. Now we're going to go ahead and select our tuning option. You notice there's four options on here, performance, towing, 87 octane, and mileage excess. Performance and towing both require 91 octane. Currently in this vehicle, we have 87 octane, so we're going to select our 87 octane tune. It's warning me here that 87 octane is the lowest octane that this tuning will operate on. Do I want to install the tuning? Sure. Currently, my vehicle has the tuning installed. Now it instructs me to turn the key off. Now it tells me to go ahead and remove the tuner. Now that we've got the tuning installed, we're going to go ahead and take the Jeep over to the dyno and see how much power this kit really has. It's an 18% increase with nothing more than simple hand tools and about 30 minutes of your time. That wraps up our installation and dyno test of the Super Chips Trail Jammer EXT kit. Keep an eye open for future videos from Super Chips. Thanks for watching.